I go walking at least two or three times a week, and not always in dramatic landscapes like this. I go to my local park or the canal, over bridges. If I've ever got a problem, go for a good walk, and genuinely, things become clearer. There he is. Hello, Jay. How are you? Oh, look, what do you think of this as a landscape? Psychotherapist Jonathan uses walks in nature to treat his clients, and I've invited him to talk me through the benefits of being outdoors. So what is it about walking? What does it do to our brains? Why is it so good for us? So right now, we know we're, from, we're living in a culture of stress. Yeah. And, um, but when we, we're stressed, we can't think. And that's when anxiety and all of those things kick in. Stress is an energy that kind of goes inward rather than outward. You've got no way to channel it out. And that's the great thing about walking. It's great for creative thinking. Um, it's great for processing emotions. Mm. It's an absolute life requirement that we need. This is what we have to do. This is a fundamental requirement, in my opinion, for what we need to do to manage our mental health. And the great thing about it, we can do it as often as we like, and it's free. While it's not always possible to venture far from home, any outdoor green space can have a transformative effect on us. And it doesn't have to be an hour, does it? 20 minutes is enough just to kind of lower the stress hormones, and it makes a huge difference, it really does. Most cities in and around the UK have got a park, they've got oh. green spaces, so find them. <laughs> you find, they're everywhere, they're absolutely everywhere. What do you think of that? Well, it doesn't get better than that, does it? It's yeah. a really special part of the, of the countryside here. And it gives you instant headspace, for me. Yeah. It really does, you know? And creativity. Well, it's a picture in itself, isn't it? How can, it, how can this not spark creativity, you know? I'm feeling revived. I've passed my halfway point now, only another three miles to traverse. 